Ethiopia's Prime Minister has told the BBC he is not afraid of criticism from journalists, despite the country's reputation for stifling free speech. Free media is very essential for the democratic process and development, Haile Mariam de Salen said. He insisted some bloggers and reporters arrested last year were not real journalists and had terror links. Charges of terrorism have been dropped against all of the so-called Zone 9 bloggers. Five were freed in July after more than a year in jail ahead of U.S. President Barack Obama's visit, the other four were acquitted of terrorism charges by a court last month. The Zone 9 website had carried pieces critical of the government. We are not perfect. But Mr. Haile Merriam said that their profession had not prompted their arrests, rather evidence linking them to groups wanting to destabilize the government. Ethiopia has been enjoying rapid economic growth in recent years and also enjoys a close relationship with China. The Prime Minister said any decline in the global economy, be it in the European Union, Ethiopia's biggest export market, or China did not affect the country too badly as private sector investment was the main focus of its economy. Cheaper labor costs in Ethiopia could be an advantage in such an environment. More manufacturing can relocate from China to Ethiopia so it's an advantage in that sense, he said.